Hello everyone, I don't know about you, but recently I've been kind of obsessed with Hell of a Boss. I think that the relationship between Stolas and Blitz has been a major inspirational factor in encouraging me to finally start painting again since I haven't painted in, what, over four months since I released my last video? And you may notice that my channel now looks different than how it looked before, and the primary reason for that is because I realized that there was um, someone who had taken a very similar name to the name that I was using, and they are much more popular, so I figured that it would be easier. Plus, uh, as you'll soon see, I absolutely adore this character. I decided after, you know, finishing going through the show that I really wanted to make a character inspired in part by Stolas. And so that kind of began with looking up some Goetia demons, because I decided that I wanted to base my own character off of a Goetia as well. And so the Goetia demon that I decided to go with was Marquis Fenix, and I decided to change the name just a little bit because I wanted something that sounded just a little different, so I went with Fenrix. And Fenix is a phoenix with a beautiful childlike voice that directs people against looking upon them. They mistakenly believed that they were going to return to heaven after 1200 years, and Due to that idea, I kind of got the impression that um, whether or not this is actually true, that, at least for my character, uh, they aren't actually generally very malicious. They're definitely a trickster, and they might perform actions that cause harm to others, but they don't generally have any harmful meaning behind it. I imagine that, you know, they're intelligent, that they're able to shapeshift, and they use those two things in order to get to some fun. Uh, as you can see with the expression of the character, I imagine that they're a little bit flirty. And I love the design of uh, them so much that I decided that I'm going to be using them from this point forward as the face of my channel. This painting ended up taking me eight hours, and I think that a large part of that was because it has been so long since I've created a painting. But another part of it is that I just need to get better about painting what I want the end to look like, if that makes any sense. I I started with a sketch and I real I started with a sketch and I religiously stayed with that sketch and I only realize now that the sketch that I was working with um, needed a lot of work because it looked fine as a sketch, but once I tried to take that sketch and put it into a 3D form, it didn't look right. So in the future, I think I just need to be a little bit more careful about it. And now that I've gotten over this hump, I'm very inspired to keep, you know, creating artwork and everything. I think that sometimes you just, you've spent so long since the last time that you've made anything that looking upon the blank canvas feels like an insurmountable task. And, um, you know, I'm still working on kind of getting over it because it's still a bit difficult to finish anything, but um, I think I think things will be a lot better now. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoy the rest of this video, and uh, welcome Fenrix.
Thank you.